everyone welcome to watch it paint in this video it's going to be super quick i just wanted to show you a new product by game envy the creators of the hobby holder and this is their new acrylic brush beam i will leave a link in the description below 10 percent off as well uh, i do warn you i am affiliated with game envy it will support the channel purchasing from them so bear that in mind but i use their products all the time and i'm sure you're aware that i wouldn't be using something that i don't love continuously now these are the special custom watch it paint it versions of the brush beam that i got for any patreon backers that joined in the last couple of months at the executive producer so massive thank you to everybody absolutely everyone if you're watching this video thank you if you subscribe to the channel thank you very much if you like videos comment on videos get involved in the channel or Thank you all ever so much. And then a massive, massive thank you to all the patrons that really helped improve this channel over the last few years. So big, big clap. Thank you, guys. And if anybody's interested in how the channel's improved over the last few years, just roll back. Go, go and look at the videos from the beginning. Look at the sound, the lighting, the presentation, etc. So massive thank you to all the patrons over the years. There'll be no, there'll be no Kickstarters or anything like that on this channel. So that is the best way of financially supporting the channel. So cheers guys very very much now let's have a look at these brush beams as i mentioned this will be the watch it paint it version so these aren't available on the site but they have a range of different colors available for four dollars uh, let's have a look what you get in the bag so they're going to come in these little baggies you get a game mv sticker the order of the miniature that's the sort of thing you see on my painting table just mainly so i can see where the middle is to put the model back in the place it belongs game envy business card lets you know about all of their social media and what you can buy from them as well and then you're going to get the brush beam which comes in this protective paper where it's been laser cut i guess uh, it says game envy on the back or front depending on which way you put it because this this would won't be here now i do have some spares because kit sent me quite a few and there were there was a, a lower number of supporters so drop me a message if you'd like to be a, a late backer of that and i will sort you out with one of these remaining watch it paint it brand it ones it's super cool be the envy of all your friends etc etc now just to mention a little bit about the brush beam should i go build it first i feel like i'll build it through the magic of editing let's get a fully built one with all the paper peeled off back in a mo ta-da here we go guys so it's this version's black and red i think other versions come in different colors don't actually need these legs it does stand up by itself i don't know how easy it would be to knock over not super easy actually i tap that quite hard but these legs just go on the side i might put one each way you can orientate it in whichever way you want whoa Ah, that just never falls. That's so slidy on this surface. That's cool. A little fidget toy. I love fidget toys. So as I mentioned, it's going to have the Game Envy logo on it on one side, looking sharp, and it's just going to stand up. And you can put your brushes on it. I've got some brushes. Here's a brush I found earlier, and they just rest there. Now, let me just show you. Here's one I made earlier. So this is their previous MDF version, unbranded, but super neato. Now, this is not a life-changing product, guys. I'm not trying to big it up to be something. It's not. It's not going to change your life. But it is something I use every single day. And I have a lot of hobby tools, and I don't use them all every single day. This is sat to my right, just off camera. Super helpful. Keeps all of my brushes exactly where I've placed them. They don't start rolling around the desk randomly. And that does happen, even though my desk is flat. How does that happen? Somebody explain that to me. But what it actually does for me more, and these have all got the protectors on, so it's not too bad. But when I'm actually painting, I normally just chuck them on the side and through messing around with things, I end up knocking them and I keep finding my brushes pressed against something with all the bristles splayed all over. I'm just ruining brushes just because I've not got much space and I'm knocking my brushes around. So that stops that happening. What more can you want? It just keeps them a little bit safe, a little bit more organized. And the, oh, another thing I've noticed was currently selling the house. And I like to leave these out on display as like a little prop on my desk, making my desk look super sharp. But it's going to look a lot sharper with a nice acrylic one with some color in it. But yeah, I think it just makes your desk look nicer as well. If you care about your desk looking a little bit pretty, you know, pimp my desk. In fact, let me know in the comments below how you may have improved the look of your desk. I think that matters, right? We were... We work at our painting desks for hours a day. You want it looking neat. Leave me some tips below. Anyway, guys, that's it. It's available from Game Envy. Link in the description below. 
$4 and I get you 10% off if you're interested in a little bit of a discount. So once again, thank you all ever so much for watching the content over these years and massive shout out to all my patrons, which are massively supporting and making the content better and better every week, hopefully. See you all again soon. acrylic brush beams that are available on their site which i'll leave a link to the link to the description below in the description below description below <laughs>